You're such an asshole. Assholeconsulting.com. The old captain's still sick. That's why this is all. Actually, it's much longer because I'm just going to become a lazy fuck as I get older. Uh, if you have a question, go to assholeconsulting.com where I, the older, lazier, more fuckier asshole. <laughs> that didn't sound right. Uh, I will answer your questions if you have a question. And unlike your parents, teachers, guys, counselors, and other people who just uh, either want to fuck you over or are plain ignorant, not at times, not a date, I will tell you the truth. And that will help you in the long run. Dear asshole, longtime fan, first time customer, right now I'm a freshman at the University of Colorado Boulder. My parents are paying for college. I am grateful to them for that. After weeding worthless, I finally decided on majoring in computer engineering, computer science, bachelor's of science. But then I found another major, technologies, arts, and media. Damn. Oh my goodness, it's like STEAM. We added A to STEM and now it's just like... Uh, yeah, I know, arts and media it makes it sound worthless, but it's more technical than it sounds. I think the reason why it's so attractive to me is because I intended on doing my passion story-based animation on the side. Because no fucking kid that ever grew up in video with video games, starting in the mid-80s, ever had this idea before. Because we all know that studio animation and video games, that, like those guys all make a ton. There's not a flood of fucking kids like you in that market. Uh, the engineering itself is tough. No shit. Really? Is maybe that why they make the money? And one needs to sacrifice a lot of free time to get good at getting good GPA. TAM is the College of Engineering Applied Science, so it also requires rigorous math and science, as well as coding and web, web development. Well, then why don't you go get a real degree in engineering and minor in TAM? Uh my goodness, it's Tam. It even has, like, a fucking gay-sounding name. Should I major in Tam or continue with computer engineering? If not, should I minor in Tam? There you go. That's, that's, that's exactly what you should do. Look, kid, if you're going to put that much effort... I was just talking to a young gal today on the internet. Um, she was, like, getting her microbiology. She was a, a Hillary fan and, like... Sorry, I know you're all in I know who you are. I got a STEM degree. Aren't you afraid of women with STEM? I'm like, no, because it'd be nice if you fucking women actually worked real jobs for once and paid the fucking taxes that you vote for. And I said, but the problem, I was being honest, I was trying to give her an olive branch. I don't know why olive branches are more peaceful than oak branches, but I said, well, you might want to reconsider because you're putting in all this time into microbiology, which is a hard study, a hard subject, but the employment prospects just aren't there. You should, I mean, if you're going to put in that kind of effort and energy, go into a real engineering f uh, field. Not that microbiology is bullshit, it's true, but there's just no jobs. And, and that's what I do because that's all I heard because I knew it was all bullshit and we don't like to look at economics. So you face the same problem. You're going to put all this effort and energy into TAM when you're going to put putting your efforts and energy into a field that could just as easily be repurposed or purposed towards video game development but then also is a real degree um, that will get you other forms of employment if you can't find jobs uh, programming animation or video games all right because uh, let's be honest dude hey, there's going to be every kid and his mother wanting to go hey program video games hey and uh, they don't usually make it. So, <coughs> go major in computer science, maybe computer programming, up to you. Get your minor in TAM, and that would kind of teach you. And then what I would do on, on the side is you'll figure out what, needs, what languages and shit you need to learn. Uh, and then you put together your portfolio. I, I really don't think your, your degree is that important to these animation studios as long as you're like, wow, look at what this kid did. Like, you, you got to show them with your portfolio. Like, look, here's my animation. There's this guy. Um, he put together a couple cartoons. Michael Hammond? Is that it? Let me look this guy up. He did a Batman uh, uh, Terminator. It's Michael Hammond. He's on New Zealand. Just bear with me. This is totally cool. Michael Hammond. No, maybe that's not. Michael Ham Batman Predator. No. <sighs> what the fuck is it? Not Predator. What's the other A? Terminator. Mitchell Hammond. His name is Mitchell Hammond. 
Um, it look, I mean, you just watch that. And then there's the other kid that did the Japanese animated version of Star Wars. You put together something like that and you put it on YouTube, that's going to be infinitely more valuable than your degree or your minor. You're like, holy shit, look at what this kid did. So uh, that is definitely what I would do. Get, get yourself a real degree, repurpose and specialize in your minor. But for the love of God, don't get a fucking... You're right, and I won't lie to you. If I ever saw some kid going, I have a degree in technology, arts, and media. I'd say, like, hey, let me unzip my pants, and you could suck my fucking dick. I wouldn't hire you, because that is not... If I'm looking for a serious person, I want a serious degree. Not only actually a real serious degree, but one that also sounds like it. So uh, I would not do that. P.S. Um, the professor of my required literature class said that it would be a tragedy if I didn't major in literature because I was the only one in this entire section who got an A on the super easy midterm, which every other humanities and social science majors got Fs on. I said, sorry, no, good for you. Also tell them I said hello, and that you can get yourself a free degree, a free doctorate. There's this place, there's a new school. I don't know if you kids knew, but I'm going to lean in towards the microphone so you guys can hear this, but I don't want to tell. I don't want this secret to get out. You can get a doctorate in literature for free. Don't tell anybody. By going to the school called the library, and you can read all the fucking books you want. There's another place online. It's called audible.com, and you can listen. You don't even have to read, but you can take in all the world's literature that you want pretty close to free. You can, honest to God, don't tell anyone. Anyway, that's all we got. Any of you guys got questions, go to assholeconsulting.com. Check out the blog over at captaincapitalism.blogspot.com. And then look for the Clary Podcast. It's out there, and uh, you can listen to me yell and scream and curse and swear, except for the Curse Free Podcast, which I do to satisfy our religious contingent of listeners. Anyway, that's all we got. Catch your kids later. Toodles.